Hi oh guys, Matt from 123MyIT here, and welcome to the channel. Guys, if you want to do a complete backup of your iPhone with no iCloud, then this video will help. This video will show you how to back up everything, so contacts, photos, videos, and even your settings. This process will make an exact clone of your iPhone. So if you buy the new iPhone 14, you will be able to restore all your old iPhone data directly to your new iPhone 14. You will need a Mac or Windows computer to back up the iPhone data to. And once we are finished, we will restore the data back to your new iPhone. I will show you how to do this on a Mac first, and then later on I will show you how to do it on a Windows PC. You will need the USB cable that came with your iPhone. So we're going to use a USB-C to lightning cable for uh, my iPhone that we've got here. We're going to plug it into the Mac and then plug it into our iPhone. Cool, once you plug in the iPhone, if it comes up with trust this device then just click on trust and in the apple menu up top click on go then click computer and then find your iphone and click on it i find it easier to click on the little green button to expand the window so you can see everything go ahead and find the button which says manage backups you can restore your iphone from one of these backups however for this video i will delete that backup and create a new one Go ahead and click on the box which says backup all of the data on your iPhone to this Mac. Then once you do that, click on backup now. You have the option to encrypt the backups so that no one can access them and clone your iPhone. But this will require a password and if you forget that password, you won't be able to do the old backup restore. So in this example, I won't do the encrypted backup. If everything's working okay, you should see the progress bar along the bottom too. Cool, once that's done, you can see the last backup to this Mac and the time. And if you click on manage backups, you can see that the backup is listed again now. All right, so let's pretend that you've lost your iPhone or you have a new iPhone 14. I will erase this iPhone and wipe any data on it and set it back to factory defaults. So it will be like a brand new iPhone with no data on it. Great, once you see the iPhone setup screen, plug your iPhone back into the Mac and we will restore the data backup. Again, click on the iPhone on the left side. Awesome, the iPhone has come up now and you can see it has detected the backup that you made earlier and it asks if you want to restore it. Go ahead and click continue. Your iPhone will restart after it's finished applying the restore. If successful, you should see the restore completed message. You can already see that it's restored the blue wallpaper we had before. Go ahead and set up the iPhone like you would with a new phone.
sweet. Your iPhone data has been restored and you are good to go. You can see all the non-standard apps are loading. If you have a Windows PC, the process is the same. However, you will need to download iTunes. I will put a direct link in the description below as Apple make it confusing to find. Go to Google and do a search for iTunes and then on the iTunes page, scroll down to the bottom and click on the Windows link. Once you've found that, just click on the download iTunes for Windows button and go ahead and install iTunes. After iTunes installs, agree to the terms and if you get prompted to trust this computer, make sure you click trust. Plug in your iPhone to the Windows PC and select your iPhone. Tap allow. Put a tick in this computer and click on backup now. You will see the process bar across the top. And under latest backup, you will see a date and timestamp for the backup. Awesome, you have now created a backup of your iPhone on a Windows PC and you can go ahead and restore that backup to any iPhone in the future. The good thing about this method is everything is copied across and you don't need an iCloud account to do it. Guys, we upload new iPhone help videos every week, so hit that subscribe button. If this video helped you out, please leave a thumbs up and share it around. Don't forget to check out our other videos by clicking the link.